right, happening this month, we are ending March with a full week off as students are enjoying spring break next week. Here with an opportunity to keep your kids and teens engaged, we have our friend Lauren Marty from the Bakersfield Museum of Art. And I love this because many parents are like, oh yeah, it's spring break. We mm -hmm. have to make all the plans for the kids. Panic. And panic time, <laughs> right? And so camps are just such a great opportunity to really help those kids stay engaged outside of the typical classroom setting. Absolutely right. You could leave your kids at home with the Roblox and the videos and all of the things, which or they do. could engage <laughs> with art, which is what we prefer. So starting Monday, we have classes for kids and teens available. Unfortunately, our pre-K and K classes have sold out, but kids and teens can take classes using uh, clay, making clay forms, abstract collage, experimenting with chalk and oil pastels. Warning, that one will get messy. Right. Okay, because the things. And uh, <laughs> the teens even get a chance to experiment with black and white photography during one of our sessions. So it's going to be a lot of fun. I love that. You know, a little bit off topic, but it feels like with social media these days, teens are so into framing the right photo and getting those shots. So now we're teaching them the art of it. It's not just the selfie and how cute do you look. It's right. capturing that moment. And I'm black and white, it's such a beautiful medium. There, There is uh, no end of information to learn when it comes to actually composing a photo and it runs beautifully in parallel with our exhibition Modern Women, Modern Vision. So there's lots of photographs for students to actually look at mm -hmm. while they're working on these courses. You know, and just because you're not in school, that doesn't mean that there's an end to learning. Just because there's, you know, no teacher in front of you and there's no homework, it doesn't mean there isn't more to know. And that applies beautifully where art is concerned also. So we're excited to have our students come and join us. I'm just so thrilled about this. And so we have some beautiful pictures yes. from last year's spring break art mm -hmm. camp. As kids are coming in, do they bring their own lunch? Does a parent need to stay on site? What are all the details? Uh, parents are welcome to come. You're welcome to stay if you like, but you know, the kids are going to be on their own. So if you want to do a drop off, go get the coffee, come back after a little while, you're welcome to do so. Okay. And you see the, the times there and the uh, the age ranges and just go to bmoa.org forward slash spring dash workshops for details. Perfect. And then you're going to see all the details. You're going to mm -hmm. sign it up. We're going to do this next week for spring break, but we're also starting to plan ahead to summer. You're going to bring are. back this dance? Yes, yes, <gasps> yes. Uh, if you haven't signed up to get on our wait list to get the announcement, do that at bmoa.org. You can navigate your way to education. You'll see the link for summer camp. Get on the list. That way you will get first shot when the classes are announced. So exciting. So this is next week for the kids. We'll mm -hmm. bring you back next week to talk about Art After Dark for the grown-ups.